Yeah, I will. I will say. I will. I will say to whomever is in the chat, y'all. It's some crazy ass shit going on, and when y'all see, you know, I've I just been being quiet. I ain't been saying shit, but I definitely know it's some other shit going on, just from movement, just from the movements, and then Ashley was going back, fucking reporting everything that was going on in my mama house to Paris, and you know. I had reached out to Paris and she never answered. So I blocked the bitch and I went live and I'm just like, Paris come into life. It's like, she just went not respond to me because it's like Paris kept dragging me in drama. I'm like, Paris, don't you see I'm doing something totally different. I don't feel like you're my friend. Cause if you're my friend and you see me trying to elevate and do something new, why are you consistently dragging me in drama about Keisha? That's why when I was on her live last time, I ain't say shit. I was just laughing at her ass because I'm like, sis, it, and let me tell y'all what Paris did. I'm going to just tell y'all, and I know she may hear it. This is why I'm pissed with Paris because I, when I, the day before I had spoke to Paris and I told Paris, I was like, yeah, Paris, I'm not, you know, going to be on live talking about shit because I'm trying to go a different way and I don't want to keep accumulating karma. So Paris called me, hey girl, you know, everybody worried about you. And I'm like, oh yeah. Yeah, they everybody worried about you. And she just talking. We we talking, having a normal conversation. And this bitch talking about, oh, matter of fact, do you want to say hey um, to everybody to let them know you're doing fine? This bitch had already had the live up when she called me. I had no idea she was. And then I looked at the title and I'm like, bitch, did you really? That. She, she, that's funny because we. I was saying that. I was like, she needed, didn't even know she was on live. And she put you in the title because she wanted you to come on a live, but she wasn't really trying to come on a live. I didn't That's know. Only... Yeah, but I was saying, wasn't I saying that? I was like, she needed probably didn't even know he was, she was on a live because he was he he was trying to threaten this series on Keisha, but he didn't have nothing. Like he didn't have anything. That's why he kept doing it. He kept doing it. Even now, he's trying to call out on other people to talk about Keisha. Like he's weird. I mean, but like, why would you? If I just told you that I'm not trying to get in drama. Why in the hell would you set me up like that? And then I did, exactly. you know, have a, a look at that video where, um, you know, she was reviewing a vlog that I did, but that shit wasn't, bro, that shit wasn't really funny when motherfuckers sending pizza and shit to my house. And it I was in my bed off. sleeping and woke up to like 50 fucking DMs. I'm like, she was talking about me for what? I ain't never, I didn't even speak to Paris for like a whole week. So I'm just like, why in the fuck are you doing a reaction video? Like do an actual reaction video to something that's funny. Like react to my music or something. Like why are you reacting to some shit like that? That wasn't funny to me. He just did it because he didn't have, Paris didn't have nothing to talk about. He had promised all of them people that he had a series on Keisha. They was pressing him to talk about Keisha and he didn't have nothing to talk about. So he didn't have nothing. He didn't have nothing. He had talked to her already. Like he didn't have anything to talk to Keisha about Keisha. Like he didn't have nothing. But so, she, you protecting uh, fucking Ashley though. It's like you trying to yeah. hide Ashley, but keep me in drama to talk about Keisha. But I don't have shit to say unless I got some shit to say. You know, I had already spoke after I did the interview with her. I pretty much said what the fuck I needed to say in the interview. And I'm just like, you, you, why the hell would you call somebody and act like you genuinely care about my well being, but you got a live up and then gonna throw me in the live with a title like I'm about to talk shit about Keisha and she just talking all this shit and I'm just laughing. I'm like, since you really think I'm stupid, like, so they didn't ask about me. That was just the way for you to get me on your live. And so a lot of people wondering why I don't like Paris. I don't like Paris because if you were my friend, you would not have tried to insert me in drama to make me go backwards when you see I'm moving forward. Real friends don't do that. You should respect my progress. And I didn't appreciate that. So I'm Paris trying to see what this is all about. Paris wanted to have like an inside scoop on... But she already had one. Ashley was telling her all my mama fucking business that was going on in the house. Well, well, what I'm saying is, yeah, well, that, but she wanted, she, that wasn't enough. Ashley wasn't fucking with her no more. Like, she wanted the inside school. So that's why she reached out to Alexa. She wanted, she reached out to everybody that Keisha knows. She's trying to reach out so she could seem like she, like when I came, she felt like I know Keisha, so I have an inside situation. And Paris felt like 
what he wanted to have that. So that's why he always be like, oh, Mama Pastel reached out to me. Like, he's weird. He's weird. And that's not journalism or nothing. That is just being weird. And now he's like, even with the recordings he's playing, talking about Keisha trying to set this person up and stuff, he's not playing the full recording or nothing. He's not playing. Yeah, Ashley put RuPaul in her video. Exactly. And was clearly talking about Paris. And the only reason why Ashley be talking to him is because she still, y'all talking about, why would Ashley be talking to Paris? Let's just be real. Because she still How the fuck did they link up? Anyway, that's what, but like you said, they had already planned. They knew me before I knew them. I thought they was just some random bitches, honestly. I ain't gonna lie. And um, I was, I would, I guess because they know I don't play about my family. Oh, well, let's come out and do this because I know Shindy just, and that's why I'm feeling like all this shit is not even about Jeremy. It's about me and some shit that they're hiding to try to keep me in drama so i won't be paying attention to what's really going on and then when i started paying attention to what the fuck was really going on as i'm on my journey spiritually and you know all this other shit i'm meditating all these downloads and shit i was getting and i'm just like oh now hold up where is this bitch ashley at like where is she why is she at my mama house and see the same places ashley was traveling my family was traveling there too so that's why it's this shit is way deeper than y'all know and that's why i make so many posts because when i tell y'all i literally don't have anyone in this world my mama took my children from me while i was asleep she stole their birth certificates everything and that's all around that time when ashley and all of them was over and i'm just like why the fuck josh and alexa over there so much why are all y'all over like what the fuck is really going on and now um, I can't even contact my children. Like she got my number blocked from her number and from Trey phone. Like I literally have no fucking idea what is going on. I really don't. Like I know y'all saying this about Jeremy, but honestly, it ain't even about Jeremy. It is it's not about him. It ain't got about, shit to do with him. Yeah, but it's really the whole situation is about Keisha. The reason why Paris wanted to link up with um Shanita so much. My whole thing is if you want to link up with Shanita, be genuine. And want to link up with Shanita, but you want to link up with Shanita because you know that she drags Keisha, so that's why. And you you felt like she was gonna, you know, because Keisha he, Shanita don't fuck with Keisha, so she's gonna just go get on your channel or whatever, and people gonna forget that she was supposed to be doing a series on Keisha, and you are gonna start talking to Shanita. Shanita has already aired out whatever the fuck she need to air out. When and but, to air but out, did y'all not see? I ain't been saying anything about Keisha, not even with Paris. The only reason why I did speak and go in on Keisha is because I had never watched the video. So the points that Paris had been picking out, I'm just like, I know goddamn well she didn't say that shit. Nah, hell no. You know, so that's what all that was about. But I did it, that shit in that interview. And it was dead even before that. She was yeah. like, well, girl, I looked at the video and... You know, I I mean, if you want to come on, video. And Paris ain't even look at the damn video. Hmm. I bet you Paris ain't even look at the damn video. I'm talking about Keisha did a video years ago about about you. Yeah, but I'm saying she probably skimmed through it because of some of the stuff. I mean, yeah, you know, but I myself, I never went and watched it. I just had a problem with it still being up because my mama made me take my videos down, but she didn't tell Keisha to take her video down about me. Keisha took videos down about everybody else but me. So I'm just like, well, I feel like this shit got something to do with me because at the end of the day, I still am not understanding why the fuck they had to do all of that shit. Like, when I was minding, y'all know I was minding my business. I started doing my tarot cards. I was minding my business. And then, boom, here come Ashley and fucking Hazel. Teamed up with Paris. And um, I'm just like, well, who are these bitches right here? Maybe they want my attention because y'all know I'm about to go ham on them. Okay, so Paris is lied and said that they reached out to that they, that, that, um. They reached out to him, but he actually reached out to Ashley. What? Yeah. How the fuck did she find Ashley? That's what I'm saying. How did she find her? When you know when they did a um when they did uh when they, when they you know when they uh they was already not like reached out, they reached Paris did a video after Ashley was already like fam. They did a lot a pair on Paris Live. Oh, y'all. And I got more receipts on that Brilliant Breeze situation. I actually did find the person that she was talking about was a reactor. And Brilliant Breeze, 
your lying ass. I'm like, I don't know if I'm a, I, I ain't gonna come Greg back. And Brie, that goddamn cancel looking like bitch. That. Ain't nobody stunning her. My no, thing she is, is like she not lying. Act like she not worried about it. like you want to keep on acting like you want to come outside, throw a little shade and shit, bitch. No, I found this. I found the person that you lied about making it seem like it was all these reactions. So bitch. why I is Trolletta coming back up again? Is she working with Trolletta? Because Paris, no, Paris lied. Paris played a part of a, a clip of an audio of Keisha and made it seem as though Keisha was trying to set Trolletta up. The conversation had nothing to do with Trolletta. Keisha did mention Trolletta, but the conversation had nothing to do with Trolletta. Nothing. She was talking about Paris's discord. Was saying save yourself for them people not trying to save you when people okay. Speaking of discord, speaking of discord, you do you know who the fuck Leah Denise is? Yeah, why were what's wrong with Leah? What happened? She's a goofball, but who is she? Like, is she like super close to Paris or something? She be, uh, I don't even know if she's still messing with Paris now, but she was. She be, is, is Leah is Leah still in the Discord? Because I like, love Leah. You know, Leah reached out to me, and Leah's, she's pretty cool. She's been genuine to me, so I don't know, you know, because she is, the worst, she is, she is all, she is one of those people. She's like one of them Keisha haters that's oddly obsessed with her. Like, she be on every single post, like every single thing. Like, she just really hate Keisha. Okay. I don't know. But Leah, that's, so that's my girl. She, she um, she just on a bandwagon. So she with Paris. Yeah, well, yeah, she was, but she was one of Paris's mods, and she was in the Discord. She was always in the Discord, but a lot of the people stopped fucking with Paris and start fucking with Hazel. They left Paris Discord and now they in Hazel Discord. And Hazel, uh -uh. yeah, because Hazel talking all that cold case shit ain't gonna do nothing. Hazel came back out because, you know, she got a, a, a grand closing. She got what? She's supposed to be opening up a um, store or something. So she thought she was coming out bucking bad, um, putting people address out like she ain't going like, to I mean, seem her. like every time that bitch about to launch something, she want to come out. Just like with them goddamn pillowcases. 